I became a hairdresser over 20 years ago. I always liked the idea of making people feel better about themselves. I had started to work with hair loss rather than just with hairdressing and that had come about because a friend of mine had come to me and she was diagnosed with breast cancer and she was about to lose her hair. She had gone through a bit of a difficult experience when it came to choosing a wig through the NHS and she just really felt that if she'd have had a different experience she would have dealt with her hair loss a lot better. She was just grateful she had me who was, as her friend who was a hairdresser who could help her. So that made me really want to try and make that experience better, take it away from a hospital environment, have it more as a salon experience and I really felt that I owed it to her legacy to really do what she'd asked me to do. I realised how many more people suffered from hair loss from other medical problems and it opened a whole new journey for me. I found out when I was 12 years old that I was suffering with alopecia. I didn't really know the first thing about it or what to do. Yeah, I mean, I had no confidence back then. Rebecca made me just feel like I can be myself and it's nothing to kind of judge about. When I had the email to say that we were a finalist for a St David's Award, I was absolutely ecstatic, really humbled that a small business like us has been chosen for this.